Hello you guys and welcome back to another video. If you're new here, my name is Jackie and in today's video I have another little thrift haul to share with you guys. So I'm just going to go ahead and get into it. The footage that I'm about to share with you guys from the actual stores is just over the course of the last week and a half and I've gone to a couple different thrift stores so let me show you guys because there was so many fun things in store and then at the end I'll show you guys a haul of what I ended up getting. So the first thing that caught my eye was this beautiful wooden dresser. It was only $25, which is insane. If I needed a dresser, I totally would have gotten it. I love the style. And then here's just a basket of all the little trinkets that I had been collecting as I was going through this particular thrift store. These candle holders caught my eye just because of the texture they're actually really heavy and i thought they would look really cool styled on a shelf and then i spotted this cute little wooden rocking chair that would be so fun as a little kid's toy with spring and summer around the corner i have been checking the dress section every time i go to the thrift store i've been really into floor prints so um, i always just check to see if there's anything cute and girly and fun that I could um, use during the spring and summer time that's coming up. I love the material of this shirt, this cotton gauze material. I feel like it's very comfortable. So that caught my eye. And then this cute shirt with the um, big collar, that was really cute too. And then this was a really cool find too, except I did turn it around and see that it was a little dirty on the backside. So I passed on it. All right, so I'm gonna start off with the clothing items first. And um, this one is actually, I got this a long, not a long time ago, but maybe a month or two ago, but I forgot to throw it in my previous thrift hauls. So I thought I would share with you guys because it is a very good find. It's this jacket right here, and it's actually by Free People, um, Free People Movement, I believe. So this was just like a random find that I came across at a Plato's Closet. I believe these retail for like 130 or maybe like 150 somewhere around there um, but I got it for 30 bucks it's this really pretty I don't know like turquoise no it's like a dark teal color um, but yeah it's just a really nice fit I've been wearing it a ton already let me see if I can show you guys here on camera um, but yeah this is what it looks like and I just love it it's like very casual and it's just like a cool, cool look. So I love this jacket. I'm gonna hold on to it um, for years to come, hopefully. All right, so I have all my clothing items here. Um, and then I will show you the home things after that. So first off, for the kiddos, uh, or for babies, I guess, this little onesie, I thought it was so cute. It's just like this, pretty blue color it has like this I don't know what this is called but it's like the backing where you can just undo it and then your little bum is right there and this one was 350 and then I found another sleeper and this isn't a bigger size this is size 9 to 12 months and this is from the brand loved baby which is organic cotton and I actually have had a couple of their sleepers I purchased new for my daughter when she was like a newborn um, and I really like the quality of them so um, I found this one and I thought I would grab it in this bigger size 350 as well um, and just this beautiful green color all right next up is a cute little shirt that I found for my three-year-old um, this might fit her now if not next year this is from H&M it's size three three to four and this one was five 50 or five I'm sorry five dollars so it's just this cute little muslin cotton top um, with some wood buttons and this little cute like small Peter Pan collar so so cute and cozy so those are all of the kids items and then I actually grabbed a couple items for myself as well so first off is this tank top and it's a hundred percent cashmere in this beautiful oatmeal creamish color. I thought this was just so cute to layer under a cardigan or I don't know if it would look cute on top of like a white long sleeve, but 
Um, it's super soft, good material, and so I thought that was really cute to grab. And that one was $3.99. And then next up is this little Zara top that I thought was just so cute with all the little details on it that you'll see here. This one was $4.99, um, originally from Zara, size medium, and just look at how cute this is. This is my favorite part, the sleeves with this little lace detailing and it's cinched and I've already tried this on. It looks so cute with like a tank top underneath and probably like some high waisted jeans or even like a skirt. So it's in this beautiful like cream, uh, like a creamy white color. And again, that was $5. And then the next item here is a white cardigan. This was $9, um, size medium, 100% cotton, just like a basic knit cardigan. I'm sorry guys, I'm not doing a good job holding it up, but that's just what it looks like. So I love that one and the fit of it is really nice. And then lastly, I found this sweater from a brand called New Flora, which if you're not familiar with, they are a Christian Instagram boutique. And I've been following them for quite some time now and I love their style and their pieces. Um, I've ordered from them maybe like once or twice, but they are a little bit expensive in my opinion. This sweater in particular was originally, is originally $69 and they still have it on their website. And I was surprised to find them at the thrift store. Um, it was a pleasant surprise. So this one was $8.99 and it's this sweater here. And actually the funny thing was I, I've been eyeing this sweater when it first came out. I wanted, like this was a sweater that I wanted to potentially invest in, but I kind of felt like, you know, I don't want to spend like $70 on a sweater. It's just hard for me to justify investing like 70 to 100 something dollars on one single piece when I know I could find something similar at the thrift store for a fraction of the price. So that's kind of my way of thinking. I mean, I have invested in some pieces in my closet. I'm not saying I don't, you know, purchase anything new, but I have gotten to the point where I would say like 95% of the times I'm thrifting so that's just personally how I shop and I find that it's a really great way to save money and um, also like to be able to, I guess, try trendier things without splurging on a piece of clothing that you're only going to wear for a short amount of time. So that's my little spiel there, but anyways. I'm glad I did not splurge and spend the $70 on this sweater because I found it at the thrift store for $9 versus having to pay $70 plus shipping for it. Next up are my home things. So I'll show you guys first this basket because it's just beautiful. Um, it's a bigger basket. It has this handle and obviously the floor print, I mean, that's really what makes it special. So I already um, have taken this off and washed it and everything so it's clean. But yeah, I just love, I just love it. It's so pretty and I feel like it'd be really cute um, to hold like books or um, just like knickknacks around the house. I feel like uh, baskets are just a really great way to organize and um, make a space look a little bit cleaner if you just throw everything into a basket. Um, I have this stuff inside of this basket, so I'll just kind of pull things out. But first off is this gingham fabric. So love this brown um, brown and white gingham fabric. This was $2.90. I have a couple vases that I grabbed. This one was $3.40, and I just love this like ribbon um, around it. I thought it was such a pretty like classy but more of like a modern detail so um this is really pretty for like um flowers and bouquets as a centerpiece or like even if you want to put like a candle inside i feel whoop, i feel like it would be just a really pretty piece to put out somewhere on a table and then i grab these two little jars here for 250 each 
They're also um, not the exact same size, if you can see that. So one's slightly bigger, and I feel like this would just look so pretty with flowers, like a couple stems of flowers. These are just fun to have for flowers. So grab those two. Oops. Okay, next up are these little berry dishes. Look how cute. I love the fun bright colors. This like lime green slash yellowish one and then this green one. Um, yeah, just so cute. $3 each and there's just not really much to say about them other than they're very cute and just like a fun pop of color. All right, next up is another little basket. So this is just like a really cute basket for small toy pieces. I love finding baskets like this for my kids stuff. So like whether it's craft supplies like crayons, markers, or if I have like a toy set that has um, a lot of little pieces, I can place them in here. This was $3 and I just, I like that basket. And then lastly is this little wooden um, spatula. So I've actually been wanting to get some more wooden kitchen utensils. Um, so yeah, this one, I mean, it looks pretty much new or unused. Um, it was $3 and it's like this really cool shape. I wonder if I could use this to like flip pancakes. I'm going to try, but yeah. So that is pretty much it for my haul today. I hope that you guys enjoyed watching. Um, I know it was kind of a smaller haul, but that's why I love thrifting because you can just frequent the thrift store and find like little treasures every time you go. So again, thank you guys for watching and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.